IonQ is a quantum computing stock that I currently hold that I believe has the potential to be a massive player in the quantum computing industry over the next decade. And in IonQ's most recent update, they announced an agreement with the United Arab Emirates Quantum Research Center Technology Innovation Institute. So on April 26, INQ announced a new agreement with Abu Dhabi's Quantum Research Center Technology Innovation Institute in the United Arab Emirates. This agreement will provide the research center with access to INQ's industry-leading ARIA quantum computer, enabling the testing and execution of quantum algorithms. So essentially, this contract is going to provide engineers, computer scientists, and physicists with direct access to INQ's system for quantum algorithm experimentation. And one of the reasons that I think this is so important is due to the rapid rise of artificial intelligence that has taken place over this year. You can bet that as AI becomes more and more advanced, the reliance on quantum computers over classical computers is not only going to be preferred, but be essential. And according to Peter Chapman, the CEO and president of INQ, we are pleased to provide the Technology Innovation Institute with access to what we believe is the world's most powerful, commercially available quantum computer as they look to develop quantum algorithms to tackle today's most complex problems. Interest in quantum computing has grown throughout the region these last few years, and INQ is proud to be recognized as a leading driver of quantum hardware innovation and accessibility. Moreover, in recent years, the UAE government has actually allocated millions of dollars to support the research center and advance the country's rapidly growing quantum computing industry. Consisting of a wide array of the world's leading scientists, researchers, and engineers, the institute in Abu Dhabi focuses its attention on creating better quantum algorithms on commercially available quantum systems. So I think you have to look at this announcement as furthering the research center's efforts for developing, benchmarking, and optimizing novel quantum algorithms, as well as quantum device characterization and quantum error mitigation techniques. And INQ's agreement with the research center in the UAE is the latest in a string of international developments for INQ in recent months. And I honestly think this is really important because if we look back to January this year, INQ acquired the Canadian-based startup Entangled Networks for its quantum networking enterprise, opening its very first office in Canada. And furthermore, this move closely followed the establishment of two international business entities in Germany and Israel last year, marking INQ's world-class systems accessibility to a range of European companies, states, and governments. But yeah, I know overall, progress can sometimes seem kind of slow with these startup companies, but I honestly have to say, I'm really liking the path that INQ is going down right now. I think providing their technology to the rest of the world is going to be a huge step for opening up the company's total addressable market, which of course is only going to do wonders for the stock in the long run. And with that, I think I'd like to wrap up the video here. Thanks as always, and I'll catch you next time.